The next question is in uh, chapter 4, number 2a, and this illustrates reading the latitude and longitude of a known point on the chart. When we look at this chart, we see that the vertical scale here is the latitudes, and this shows 26 degrees, 5 minutes, 10 minutes, and so forth, and each of these major divisions is one minute of latitude. And then within that major division are ten small ticks, and each of those ticks is therefore one-tenth of a minute. So the longitude is set up in a similar manner here, 75 degrees, five minutes, ten minutes, and then there's major divisions or whole minutes, and each little tick is one-tenth of a minute. So question number 2a asks for the latitude and longitude of point A. So here's point A, and let's look at the latitude and longitude of it. Well, to get that, I'm going to use my parallel rules and first off ensure that they're parallel to this bottom scale. The one that's not moving, you have to hold press down very, very hard to ensure that it doesn't slip. So I've walked this all the way up and I can draw a line across. I can read from that a latitude of 2609.52. Um, and that's my latitude. So that number is 26 degrees, 09.52, 09.52 minutes north. Now notice when this is written, 26 degrees, little little tiny degree circle up there, 09, now a lot of times people will forget the, the, the zero, and then later on when they're maybe adding some numbers or doing some work with those numbers, they get fouled up because they don't use that leading zero here. You should use always two digits. So that's zero nine point five two and that's a decimal point. So that's fifty two hundredths of a minute. So that's the latitude. To do the longitude we'll do a similar thing. We'll put the, the scale vertically on this vertical scale to get it nice and parallel. So we go through this A again, and down here I have my um, longitude 75, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 minutes, 6, 7, 8, 75 degrees, 8.4. So 75 degrees, 0, 8.4 minutes west. And that's how you would measure latitude and longitude using these scales.